Weather 12 forecast. Going to want to make sure those windshield wipers are working today. You're going to need them off and on starting this morning lasting into the evening. Let's look first at our live radar and you can see that the first drops of rain are just starting to push into western Rhode Island right now. I'm scattered light showers for the morning commute, a little steadier and heavier to the north of us here. And we're going to continue to see the risk of showers. And as we look west, you see them moving through New York City this morning, western Connecticut. We've got our threat tracker in the green. I'm not expecting severe weather. There's a low chance for a rumble of thunder. We're back to drier weather Friday, uh, Thursday. It looks like through the daytime on Friday as well. We've had a little glimmer of sun here and there this morning, but clouds are still dominating the skies in New Bedford. Our temperatures there at 49 degrees, upper 40s to near 50 in westerly Newport and Providence. And we're in the middle 40s in Ton right now, Willimantic at 49. Light winds they will be out of the southeast today and staying between about 5 and 10 miles per hour. So an occasional swipe of your windshield wipers uh, this morning and then this afternoon and this evening, especially early in the evening, we're going to continue with the chance for those scattered showers. Temperatures in the evening still very mild, upper 50s, at least for evening hours. So the temperatures today Another day where we're in the 50s. 9 o'clock this morning, these spotty showers continuing to press in. This is at noon. Isolated downpour or thunderstorm. We'll see middle and upper 50s at 5 o'clock in the evening. Still some scattered showers around early in the evening, but then that trend will be drying up and we'll be back under some partial clearing heading into the overnight hours. We're looking at about a quarter to on the high end near a half an inch of rain. Most of us ending up between about a quarter and a third of an inch of rain today. Tonight drying up temperatures stay mild upper 40s for overnight lows. That leads us to some great weather tomorrow. We'll be up near 70 degrees inland and making it into the 60s along the coast before a sea breeze develops in the afternoon. So as far as the weekend goes, we do have a chance for some showers Friday night into Saturday as we watch this area of low pressure. It's a very close call with this rainfall. High pressure is going to try to build in and block it from coming northward. If this nudges any further north, then we've got a higher chance of rainfall. That high can build in a little sooner and a little more oomph to it, then we should be able to keep most of the rain, if not all of it, to the south of us. As that low continues to press further away on Sunday, skies will brighten up, but it'll be breezy and cool for a few days this weekend and early next week. Here's the seven day forecast 58 for today, near 70 with some mostly sunny skies. Tomorrow it's the pick of the week. Increasing clouds dry during the day on Friday with a chance for some showers at night and we'll keep an eye on that threat of at least some showers along the coastline Saturday morning for Mother's Day on Sunday upper 50s a little breezy, but it does look dry in Smithfield and Providence taking my mountain Newport upper 50s. They're climbing back up into the 60s and next week looks not only milder, but drier than what we've been dealing with so far this week.